What's going on YouTube? Geosno right here. Today I have great news for those of you waiting for jailbreak features or a jailbreak on iOS 16 up to 16.1.2 on all devices. A new application which is based on a jailbreak exploit and it allows you to customize your device even further has been released. This video is brought to you by AnyUnlock, a software that allows you to unlock your screen passcode, bypass MDM, remove SIM lock and even turn off screen time passcode if you forgot those. Definitely check the program out in the link below. Pretty good for secondhand devices. So a couple of hours ago this developer posted this, quote, release file switcher 0.1 for iOS 14 up to 16.1.2. And this is completely open source available over here, file switcher 10, which basically you install and it allows you to customize the dock a little bit. It allows you to customize the color of folders and remove the folder outline and stuff like that. Customize the sounds on the device and you know, the sound when you plug in the charger and things like that. This is all based on an exploit that was patched on iOS 16.2. So if you're running 16.2, this will not work however you can still downgrade the 16.1.2 at the moment using the delay OTA method definitely check that one out so this application like the one with the fonts which allows you to change the fonts and is based on the same exploit this one you can install as an IPA file the IPA is available here on the releases on github you get the IPA file and once you have it it looks like this and you can basically sideload it with sideloadly or anything you want I have it on my device so let's see it in action so I have here a device running 16. 1.1 and as you can see this is file switcher 10 once you install it it looks like this it may ask you for location services that's necessary in order to work in order to change the files because I think they depend on location or whatever. And here you can customize the home bar. You have home bar assets .car, doc dark, doc light, a folder dark, folder light, shortcut banner. And then you have a couple of sounds that you can change in here. For example, the low power sound and even the connect power sound. So when you plug in the charger, it makes a different sound than the default one. You can even change the key presses and stuff like that. And once you selected everything you wanted, you press apply in there and you will press restart springboard in there. However, I have already applied them. And as you can see, I don't have an out line for the dock anymore but the folders still have this ugly background so I'm gonna go here on file switcher and I'm gonna go with folder light in there apply and restart all right so that's done and as you can see now my folders do not have any background anymore the dock doesn't have a background either and this works on both light mode and dark mode now remember this tweaks your device completely without a jailbreak it does use a jailbreak exploit in the background and we might even be able to see a jailbreak in the future based on this but this does not require a jailbreak so yep, that's basically Thank you for watching, I'm Geo Snow, peace out.